My name's Thelma and I'm one half of Bernstock Spears and we make hats and I love cats. In the 80s, the club scene was really rife and fashion students and fashion people, we used to go out and uh, artists and people used to dress up a lot and like customise their own thing. You were always thinking about what you were wearing. I mean, you didn't have a day when you were like, I'll just wear my jeans, you know. So there were people doing hats, like occasion hats, even then, like Stephen Jones was starting up. But we wanted to do something more like for club people, like caps and things that you could wear to go out. The first hat we designed actually was topless. We called it the topless hat, and it was um, a brim, quite a big a brim, and then we had jersey at the top, and your hair came out the top. One thing we do is like a bubble hat with a veil. I like that one because it sort of combines the sort of utility with the sort of glamour thing. We, we like that utility feeling. We did some hats for Gautier in the 90s, like, and it was costumes throughout the ages. So it sort of started in 1900 and it sort of went, and we did a hat for each, uh, each decade and that was really challenging. Yeah, because when you're doing a collection, you kind of, me and Paul always just talk about what, a mood, I guess. You know, we're the same age, so we have references from the 70s, you know, and the 80s. We did a hat for uh, a cycling cap. It's like a, it's got cat ears. So it's a cool cat hat, we call it, and it's a cycling cap. We got our first cat in 93. I didn't really think about having cats. I mean, I liked them as a child and stuff, but I didn't sort of think, oh, I'm a really big cat lover. And then we got these two kittens, and I was just like, oh my god, I love them. They do really funny things. They have their own little traits. Like, Captain used to, he's a bit old now, but he used to sit on the uh, counter in the kitchen and just, like, knock things off, you know. And we'd have a little bet on how quickly he could do. They fight, but I mean, like fun fights. That's always good fun to watch. Captain always wins. 